Hi Virgo, welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. I do your reading almost daily and I upload your videos right away. So these messages are current. In this reading, we are going to find out for those of you in separation with your person, how do they feel about you right now? This is a general reading and it will not resonate with each and every one of you. Spirits and angels, please show me how does Virgo's person in separation feel about Virgo right now? Eight of Pentacles in reverse at the bottom of the deck. Virgo, this is your energy. I feel like uh, right now they feel unless worlds are being reversed, yeah, which is possible. Um, your person feels like you're not concentrating on them right now, and they're feeling kind of overwhelmed with the King of Cups here in reverse, feeling uh, emotionally unstable because definitely you and this person are separated right now. The Death card and the Ten of Swords indicates an ending, but the Death can also indicate transformation. So. Your person will be feeling like this. Um, there needs to be a big change happening um, in order for both of you to reconcile because we've got the Ten of Cups here. So they are unclear right now. Ace of Swords and Reverse. When I was shuffling early on, this card came out too. So this is the second time. <laughs> so that means I feel like your person could be confused or they may not. Um, they may not be 100% clear as to what they want, how they feel, except for the fact that um, both of you are separated, Ten of Swords, and that they are very devastated. But what I meant was how they feel about the future for the both of you, Ten of Cups. They're not sure uh, how things are going to pan out for the both of you. Will both of you reconcile, or will this ending be a permanent ending with the Death card here? So it's still kind of unclear how they feel about the future for you. Um, yeah but the nine of cups here indicates them loving you or that they do have romantic feelings for you and the king of swords here is in one verse why are the swords in one verse when swords can indicate communication as well maybe they feel like both of you are not communicating right now or both of you cannot communicate well or efficiently maybe there could have been misunderstandings between two of you if it's not that maybe somebody was lying right the swords and lovers can also indicate not really telling the truth so it can be any of these things but we're asking about their feelings five of pentacles here indicates them feeling um uh lost they're feeling lost without you because you know maybe you and them these two people used to be together right um hmm. but the ten of swords here indicates that's this ending of this partnership so one person is no longer um doing what they used to do for the other person and six of wands here You know what? You're confusing them, Virgo, because six of wands, this could be you doing well for yourself or that uh, you could be dating other people or recently you may have achieved something. You seem to be okay. That's what I'm getting here. You seem to be okay. This is such like a big, like a big difference. Six of wands feels happier than the ten of swords so they may be feeling like you have abandoned them or feeling left out in a cold um hmm. feeling a little bit victimized as well virgo because if they see you as the six of wands here that means you know you're sitting on your high horse not in a bad way but you know sitting on a high horse just you know doing well for yourself or you could be happy or happier without them with the ten of cups at least that's what you could be showing if that's not how you really feel because the six of wands you know th there are these supporters here these are the ones here for me it's a bit like a show isn't it <laughs> six of wands it looks like a show someone is showing something showing that they have achieved something but it may or may not be true virgo but if you've been showing uh, whether it's on your social media to your friends or 
telling them if there has been communication but i see there's very little communication between two of you or no communication at all they may be very sad very devastated because you're doing well for yourself while they are kind of struggling with the five pentacles here i remember um that was one time when i broke up with my ex-fiance what hurt him the most he told me eventually what hurt him the most was how he was struggling to move on uh, while i was just he saw I was just okay. I was just, you know, moving on from my life and just continuing. Like, life didn't stop for me. So that actually made him feel even worse about the breakup, right? So if some of you, it could be that. They, must, uh, they could be feeling really bad about the breakup because you may have seemed unfazed uh, by the separation. Hmm. Let's see more for go. So we got the Eight of Pentacles in what first, Page of Wands in what first. Yeah, they feel like you're not, I, you're not talking to them. Page is a messenger. Really being reversed, maybe some of you, you're not replying to the messages or you haven't reached out to them ever since the separation. Three of Pentacles here is in what verse and the Empress in what verse. They feel like you don't care about them anymore or that you don't care about reconciling with them. And Five of Wands here is in what verse. And Nine of Pentacles in reverse can indicate them feeling codependent on you. But Five Wands in reverse can indicate also maybe they feel like they would like to end this conflict between the two of you. But the Five of Wands also can indicate fighting, you know. I feel like you are not fighting. You're not fighting for this connection. And for some of you, Virgo, Nine of Pentacles in reverse can also indicate you. Perhaps for some of you, if you're not single anymore, ever since the separation, you this could be them feeling this way, whether you have somebody or not. Um, but the Nine of Pentacles in reverse also can you get codependency. So they feel like they need you. Maybe they need you emotionally. Uh, you could have been dealing with someone who has, you know, emotional issues. Could be anxiety, could be depression. Um... But maybe you were always at their corner, but now you no longer do. So yeah, the death card as the last card here for me indicates obviously a separation, but there is this Ten of Cups, super happy, and then we've got this death card here, which I don't think it's a bad thing at all. So they feel like, obviously with the Ace of Swords here, Above the Ten of Cups in reverse for me indicates they are unclear or unsure if this connection, you and them are going to reconcile Ten of Cups, get back together, or is this separation going to be a permanent separation? So they are unsure about how things are going to pan out between two of you. But they could also be thinking that in order for both of you to reconcile, maybe there needs to be a very big change again with the death card here. Huge transformation before both of you can reconcile. But let's see more. Or oh, something needs to end before both of you can reconcile. So your person misses you, Six of Cups. They reminisce about the good times both of you have shared with each other. And of course, they do love you, Queen of Cups here. Could be dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpio. And a Page of Wands. Fire Sun, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, Strong Leo here with the Sun, and we've got these Seven of Wands. Yeah, they feel like right now you could be very de defensive, you may have your guards up, and you have your boundaries that you do not want them to cross. They know that very clearly now, the Sun, so they may have to come correct uh, at you if, if they want to reconcile. So something that needs to change or transform, right, in order for both of you to reconcile. But the sun here also can indicate them uh, seeing things very clearly for what it is, right? And for who you are actually as a person, they may have underestimate, underestimated you uh, in some way, shape or form. And the nine of swords here in reverse can indicate, you know, they thought, Virgo, they thought you wouldn't survive this, this separation. But for a lot of you, you're surviving or maybe you're doing better or that you're showing to them that you're doing better. And now they see clearly who you are as a person. But also, the sun can indicate happiness. We've got the Six of Cups here. So they've been um, thinking about happy times, really happy times um, in the past. Both. I mean, in the past, um, 
good experiences, happy experiences with you. But right now, they feel like maybe you are blocking them, seven, seven of wands here, from coming back in. Three of swords in reverse, yeah, they could be feeling like you're going through healing and recovery, or it could be them still going through healing and recovery in regards to the separation. But seeing clearly, maybe right next to the sun with the queen of cups here, can indicate it's seeing, it's seeing clearly also who you are as a person or how they f truly feel about you, which is love for sure. They do love you. Mm, how kind you are. You've been so kind, soft, gentle. Some of you, all, you may have a very good heart, but now you have become either stronger or... Like you stand your own now, Virgo. I definitely sense them feeling like they have underestimated you. Now they feel like they need you more than you need them. All right, Virgo, this is your reading. I hope you resonated. hope it has helped you in some way, shape, or form. I'm going to leave you with two playlists on the screen right now, as usual. First one is from my second channel. It's a travel vlog channel. Check it out if you want to. And the second playlist is from this channel. It has all of the readings that I've done for you and for the rest of the signs with different topics and different questions. But they're still valid readings because you guys know that I post your videos almost every single day. And also, I am open for personal readings if you'd like to book me. My information is in the description box below. For those of you who like to be notified every time when I post your videos, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button. Take care. Virgo. Bye.